Welcome back to Vitrify, the channel bringing you the most disruptive form of FPV. In today's video, we have an exciting one for you. I don't want to get into too much details yet because we got uh, we have to relocate. We need to head over to the other side of the building in a minute. A lot of people uh, out there, you have the resources to to find like um, hot air balloons or or skydivers or, or paragliders and all that stuff. Well, I don't, I don't have those resources. We're gonna be messing around with these uh, paratroopers. They're little tiny. I'll show you real quick. They're little tiny dudes with parachutes and we figured if we can manage to get it on a drone and flip it upside down or something it should be able to float and we can do a chase scene my concerns that i have in regard to this video is number one there are a lot of trees in the area number two the target itself even though i picked up the the biggest one i can find on amazon which is this one uh, I, I don't know how good I can track because I've never really tracked anything. Got a couple buddies that are going to be helping me out. It's going to be cool. It's going to be exciting. We'll get to that in just a moment here. I got new rates on this and I'm a little bit worried. So I want to try to give it a quick little fly around. Um, Jules is going to be chasing me and uh, I'm just going to be nice and smooth just to see how it goes. And hopefully these rates aren't stupid. You ready? Yeah. All right. Give it a shot. Oh man, I'm feeling some drizzles too. Let me know if I need to slow down. No, you're good. I'm gonna give this these trees a power loop. Alright, I'm by the truck. You see me? Yep, I'm, I'm right behind you. Alright, floating over the truck, going under this tree. Oh, oh, I can't see. A leaf is on my camera. Oh, no. Okay, I'm back. I lost you. Yeah. I'm circling back. Yep. I got way too far. I'm right in front of us under these trees. Yep. Oh, I'm getting them blocks. I'm getting them DJI blocks. The DJI blocks. Yeah. Um, I'm down to two bars. Same. Yep. All right, bringing it back. Oh, what is this? Pile of trash. Yep. Straight basura. All right, flying it back. Hello, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you. <laughs> I did a, a flat yaw spin just to see if I oh, <laughs> I wasn't ready for the yaw spin. Uh, no. <laughs> I was right behind you. Uh, that's funny. We're up. Battle, battle drones. For real. That's going to be a cool shot. <laughs> My battery's about. Were you looking right at me when I smashed into you? Uh, close enough. Close enough. I'm pretty sure the camera picked it up. <laughs> All right, bringing it back. Canadian geese are everyone's friend. I don't know. You ever pulled up on them? <laughs> no, no. I've never pulled up on a Canadian geese before. <laughs> 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 There's a whole field of them like when over over yonder. I don't know if y'all can see it. We're about to do this uh this launch where we send these uh, paratroopers down. So I'm hoping we don't get stuck in a tree. We're gonna do a little bit of a, a detour and walk a little bit that way because there's a bit of an open field over there that's gonna make it easier to capture this. You excited, Jules? Yeah. You yeah, ever did sure. something like this before? No, I can't. Wait. <laughs> Man. I can't wait to see how this <laughs> turn out. I tell you what. There's some actuator action going on. Actuator? So, like, yeah, we need to release the no, well, that's 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 another thing. Trying to figure out how to release this is going to be one of the tricky things because if we release it wrong, it's going to eat into the props, which is going to stop the motors, which is going to seize it up and cause it to fall from the sky. Or depending on how we release it, we may release it too quickly where it hits the ground before we can actually chase it. So, but I thought of a few things or a few different ways of trying to mount it, and I think I may have found the best for now. We're going to give it a shot, see what happens. We're at 
the open spot that we were talking about. Now we can actually figure out how to mount these things on the drone. And as I mentioned, I have a few uh, different ideas as to what should be able to work, uh, but it's all theory. So see, we got the little para glider, paratrooper, para. Parachutist tried figuring out different ways of folding this where it's gonna release easy to drop this guy and he, Here's what I figured I'll do a quick little fold no, Not too tangled not too tangled. This is what I thought should work if we put it here with his little toes right here I'm hoping that as we go up I can do a little quick little yeah. and toss him it didn't work that time, which is kind of concerning, and that's what I'm worried about, because if it goes any of the op other ways here, it's gonna eat into the, the, the prop and into the drone. It's gonna seize the motors, and the, motor the drone is gonna fall out the sky. High risk, I don't know about the reward portion of this. I'm so worried about this. I'm gonna do a quick little hover test first and make sure nothing silly happens like this. And then, Oh, that's concerning. You saw that? Yeah. It's like sucking in the, sucking it in. the thing. Yeah, that's what I'm oh, see? Oh, that's what I'm worried about. Alright, so first test was a failure. We gotta figure out how to do this. We gotta we gotta figure out how to do this right. I already know what's up. Actually, let's do them upside down. Upside down? It has to be loose enough to release. That might be a little too tight. Aggressively flick him out of there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Alright. Hover's working. Alright, we're doing this. Oh man. Releasing in three, two, one. Oh no! No! That's what I was worried about. Yep. <laughs> okay, take two, take two. So let's show you the, the contraption real quick. You got the little stick going through the, the drone as we mentioned. And hopefully if we give it a little bit of a blip. Huh? Huh? Oh no, man. <laughs> I'm gonna make it happen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just shake oh. shit out of it. I'm gonna shake it until, I'm gonna shake it till the bitch falls. Take two. Alright, I'm gonna do the shimmy shake. In three. Two, one. Get it! Second attempt went a lot better than the first, thanks to these lovely gentlemen behind me that are way smarter than me in regard to figuring shit out. One of the dudes got stuck on top of the building, the other one um, is stuck on the side of the building. There he goes, buddy. <laughs> Almost. These shoes are not the best. Got him. <laughs> there we go. And now the other one is up there, which uh, I don't really have any tools to uh, get it. So the boys are heading out to the car. It is raining. It's been a heck of a day. We couldn't save poor Green. A uh, little Green got stuck in the roof. We couldn't save him. We're going to try to come back a different day to save him. But uh, it started raining, as you can clearly see. 
Yeah, so I guess we're gonna have to stop the flying for now. But hey, if you haven't already done so, be sure to like and subscribe so we can uh, keep making this beautiful content for you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, leave a comment in the video for the most exciting part of the video that you enjoyed. But um, with that being said, thank you all for tuning in. Sincerely, I appreciate you. Uh, until next time, this is Vitrifly, I'm out.